So this is uh, Shao. Uh, Shou, sorry, this is Shou. That's how it's pronounced. Um, it's a live broadcast software kind of thing where you can broadcast your uh, gameplay on the, on the internet from your Android device. So you can sit there and play Flappy Bird all day um, and Minecraft PE or whatever you want to play. Um, and yeah, so it allows you to broadcast your gameplay to Shout.tv, kind of like uh, Twitch. So it has a bit of a, a Twitch kind of setup, Twitch TV. But um, you know, it's kind of good for people that would want to watch live broadcasts of uh, mobile games, such as Android, and it's also on iOS. If you are on Lollipop, you can also use this app without needing root access. So. That's something that's kind of been added to Lollipop. You can capture your screen and um, live broadcast with this without needing any hacks or anything. Um, you can all, like I said, you can also capture gameplay. Uh, this works with internal audio, so that's cool. Um, here's this is the game section. This you can click on certain games like Flappy Bird. <laughs> Um, modern combat, whatever, and you can broadcast that, and you can broadcast anything you really want to, uh, as long as it's there. <laughs> you could broadcast your camera if you want to, just don't beat off, you know, I don't think people want to say that, but yeah, so, so here we have the broadcast uh, tab, everything else. So we can watch someone's live broadcast playing Minecraft. Keep that light. That's dark and it shows blocks all around it. And stuff. Uh, apparently that person has a black screen. And we have someone, I think, broadcasting music. would have to say kind of illegally, but you know what? I don't care. <laughs> I don't really care. Um, let's see here. So, yeah, you can broadcast Grand Theft Auto, uh, San Andreas, Vice City. You can even broadcast streamed games, you know. So if you want to broadcast, have right down by the NVIDIA Shield portable, I can broadcast, um, you know, any kind of game I stream from my PC using Game Stream or whatever you want to do. So there you go. Now, this uh, app is now out of beta, I guess I would have to say. Is if that that's kind of how I'm understanding it. Um, so you have, what's the word? <laughs> Ugh. You can find it on the Play Store now. You used to have to go to a Google Plus page and follow the Google Plus page and all this other shit. But now you can just go to Google Play and download the app for free and just use it. <clears throat> So that's that's cool. Pull the refresh, and you can see different uh, broadcasts. Seems to change quite a bit. Um, so there's that. Uh, yeah. So some people seem to be broadcasting black screens. And uh, wow, that person is young. <laughs> um, yeah. So a lot of young people broadcasting. <laughs> You know, too young for me to feel comfortable watching it. Um, so yeah, but just wanted to point that out. It's out of beta. If you are on Lollipop, you know, like I said, you don't have to have root access to use the application. You can broadcast emulators. You could broadcast Android games, casual games, uh, hardcore games using possible streaming or more high-end Android games, or whatever you want to broadcast. You can broadcast yourself video editing if you want, or drawing a picture. Um, <clears throat> so anything you want to broadcast, it's here, but it is more gaming-focused, um, kind of like Twitch. But, yeah. So there you go. Uh, yep, yeah, that's it. So, congratulations. I don't see any camera functions, though. Let me see. I don't think there are any camera functions. Um, like a camera overlay option. I want to remove that floating mirror thing, or floating window. 
I don't know. I don't know, apparently it doesn't go away when you're recording. Hmm. But that's that. So, yeah. A lot better than when I, when I last used this uh, application, so that's cool. See ya.